help of a guide, you can climb up the limestone tier to the top of the falls, slide down the smooth section of the rock, and swim in the pool of moons at the base. Cruise ship crowds flock here when the ships are near its port, so it's best to time your visit around them. Bring a camera and wear water shoes. Please wear water shoes. Highly recommended. And appropriate clothing as chances are you'll come back soaked. Number two on the list, the Blue Hole. Typically less crowded than Duns River Falls, the alluring Blue Hole, also known as the Irene Blue Hole, is a series of picturesque jungle pools fed by waterfalls in the lush mountains, about a 25 minute drive from Ocho Rios also called Island Gully Falls, or the Secret Falls. This used to be off the main tourist track, but in recent years, it's become more popular. Several levels offer different vantage points, but the higher you climb, the less people you'll probably encounter. One of the most popular things to do here is clamber over the slick rocks above the pool, where you can play Tarzan on a rope swing Firefly is a final resting 
soak up some Jamaican history and learn all about the area's original inhabitants, the Taino Indians. Kids and adults alike will love the mini zoo with many species of endemic and exotic birds. But the highlight here is the rocky ledges and the waterfall for a fun photo op. Don't forget to bring your water shoes and camera. Last but not least, Shaw Park Gardens. High in the hills overlooking Ocho Rios and the Caribbean, Shaw Park Gardens is a sanctuary for nature lovers. Within the 25 acre grounds, you can stroll through lush botanical gardens punctuated by tropical blooms and lily top ponds. Many species of birds flit through the trees, including Jamaica's national bird, the doctor bird, also called the swallow-tailed hummingbird. A waterfall cascades through the gardens and friendly guides share their knowledge of all the botanical beauties. Don't forget to comment the Jamaican flag. If you're going to Jamaica, kudos, hats off to you. I honestly hope you have the most amazing time there. And if you've been to Jamaica and there's any tips that you can drop, any